Greetings. This is a small transmission of the local galactic government, part of the wider commonwealth of 13 galactic clusters. You can refer to us in one word. Andromedians. You may have heard of us from other sources, but allow us to establish one critical fact. During a galactic uprising that brought great destruction in one third of this galaxy, certain groups of our commonwealth joined forces with the Rebel Alliance. This alliance is led by the Draconian species, governed by 24 plus 3 council members under a high commander. This ruler goes by many names, most of which are recorded in your planet's history. Point being is that the Rebel Andromedians have been acting as intermediaries between the Draconian Alliance and Earth Governments, which they have come to control. Their goal is the enslavement of your planet, the extraction of its resources and the complete extermination of all life. Then the Draconian fleet of 118 war planets, including its two flagships, will depart for a critical nerve node of the Universal Organism. We cannot, and will not allow this to happen. Your enslavement has been orchestrated by an artificial race, that many of you consider native to your planet. It is not. During your current state, you cannot enter a direct conflict with them. This is our duty. But what you can do is protect yourselves and survive until our arrival. Operative warning is, death rises in the east but the West has been infiltrated by Eastern agents, on all levels. Deal with those agents as we deal with the real threat. We have gathered an armada of 960 war planets in multiple dimensions, 340 of which are visible to you. We have been situated around and beyond the trajectory range of Saturn. Any species activity on the inside planets is considered hostile to you. We do not use channeling. We do not send messages to psychics. We only transmit through a strict medium of neutrino beams. The clear reason is that your oppressors do not have access to this technology. Beware of what you call false flag operations. Earth will be invaded by the Draconian Alliance, posing to be us. This will include atrocities in order to condition humanity against us, and to unite you under a world government. Your Illuminati New World Order is but a predecessor of an even more cruel order, that is orchestrated by the Draconians' artificial race. The enemy, on world and off world has rejected our terms of surrender. We will intervene in massive and overwhelming force. Our 5th and 6th dimension forces have arrived at your planet, as they cannot be traced or inhibited by the Draconian Alliance. We consider your own dimension being the first, in terms of density. Translating to your terms, you are 3rd dimension, and the enemy exists up to the 5th dimension. We have forces up to the 9th. Once we secure that all the nuclear weapons, that have been placed within the Earth's crust, in order to destabilize the planet, have been neutralized, we will invade. When your rapid eye movement, during your sleep, ceases to produce erratic dreams and nightmares, know that the enemy's flagship has fallen. A flagship we call Leaven. A flagship you call a Moon. Our true arrival will be signaled by one major event, the extermination of all planetary governments. Especially those who have aligned themselves with the eruption of the upcoming world war. Until then, everything else is a lie. You were once citizens of the Galactic Commonwealth. You were invaded and enslaved. We received your distress call and we have sealed the entrances and exits of this solar system. Negotiations with the Draconian Alliance have failed. We are on our way.